Hey guys, it's Daniel Tide. I finally got some good news and some bad news. The good news is my parents are planning on offering a house. Probably gonna be out here by January. But the bad news is, can't really feel that much. So, I just wanted to let you guys know. Here's my brand new intro, along with a new video. Alright, enjoy. <laughs> Today, so this is really not an actual video, but I just find some cool stuff that I've been doing lately. So, I can't just do this before. So, so the first thing, well, the first and only thing is, I'm starting to sew. So, I've been using some of my dad's sewing stuff. Hopefully, I can get a new sewing kit, my, a sewing kit for my own for Christmas, and I, so I can start making stuff. Like, the, the one thing I made, a sock monkey. It is a little weird looking, but, you know, I'm learning. A little what? And it's really cool. I put a lot of effort into it. It took me about two, two to four hours to make. And I think it looks cool. A little weird looking, but you know, it's quirky like me. And I decided to name him. Actually, I don't know what to name him. Hmm. Never really thought of that. Maybe I could name you Coraline. I think that's a good name, Coraline. So here's my little voodoo monkey. The reason why I call him, call him the voodoo monkey is because he got stitches all over the that's pretty much exposed that I really haven't exactly hidden and you know it's creepy so yeah and my favorite part about him is that I made made it all by myself but also with it um YouTube tutorial and uh, if you guys want to go watch that YouTube tutorial, I'll put a link down in below. So yeah, if you actually guys want me to do a tutorial on how to make a sock monkey, please like this video and also comment down below what what button color eyes I should use. It kind of looks creepy like this, like. Hello, I'm gonna kill you. Pretty much, so yeah. So that's all, you know, nothing really important. 